Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. It's Rachel of Gathered Plans. I hope you're all doing well. As you can see, this is the Planning World Advent Calendar. I did purchase this in gold, silver, and rose gold because I prefer to have all three foil colors. However, you have the option to purchase just one or all of them. So I'm really, really excited. Highly recommend if you do not want to spoil your advent calendar to click out of this and I'll completely understand. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and dive right into this, talk about the experience and actually open everything in one sitting. So I've been holding on to this for a couple of weeks now and just really excited. I was kind of debating on opening it one day at a time, but honestly, I've gotten so, so busy and haven't had a chance to really sit down and film daily. So I figured it just, the next best thing was to just film everything at one time. So I hope that you enjoy. If you have any questions, please comment below and I'll be happy to help. All right, friends, so I went ahead and took everything out of the box and what came in the order is this beautiful thank you note. I love the color and the design. That is so, so pretty. And this is what was in the box. So really pretty, gorgeous. I love the idea. It's awesome. It's basically a calendar that you can sit on your desk. It's a really strong plastic material with gold hardware. So you can totally repurpose this. It says 2020 Advent Calendar Planning World and then it starts with day 12 and then it's just a continued countdown. So I want to be transparent about what happened. So this is how it was packaged in the box. But unfortunately, the initial one that I did have all of these sleeves tore. So really great concept. I love the idea. But unfortunately, I think it has a lot to do with the fact that I purchased all three foil colors. So I believe each sleeve was heavier because this is pretty top heavy. Like it could get knocked down easily with all of the stickers in there. So that's probably a huge factor. Um, I'm sure every single person's could have been different just depending on how much you purchased. But what I did was I reached out to Yuan and Yuan's just amazing, you guys. Her customer service and communication is so, so awesome. And she's just literally the sweetest thing ever. So I reached out to, to her and I asked her if this is how it was supposed to look, because I honestly had no idea. Um, and she said, you know, she was really bummed and sad that it got damaged, but that was just because of the post and how it was packaged. So. She offered to resend me a whole nother one and I said, please don't do that. One, I like to give small businesses, especially sticker shops because they have a special place in my heart. Like I like to be very understanding and give them so much grace because that's a lot of time, effort, products, money, you know, redone all over again on their end. And I was like, no, please don't do that. Just send me new sleeves. I'm sure I can just fix this and like re-sleeve every single one. And that's exactly what I did. So what she did was just send me new black sleeves, which I appreciate so, so much. And she sent them really quickly as well. So I could get this video and everything ready. If anything, I was the one behind. <laughs> so, um, what was also amazing was she went ahead and reached out to every single person that did purchase an advent calendar and asked them, if yours was damaged, please reach out to her and she'll either offer you a partial refund or send you black sleeves, like new sleeves to resleeve your stickers. But just really appreciate the transparency, honesty, and just awesome customer service. So thank you for that. And really, this is just paper and plastic. So really quick, easy fix. All right, so I'm going to open each day one at a time and I'm super, super excited. This is so beautiful. I'm glad that she created something that you can reuse. Oh my gosh, yep, like I told you, top heavy. That's what I get for wanting all three foil colors. <laughs> okay, so here is the front page and you just flip it over. So day 12, again, like I said, I'm just going to take everything out all together just because I have no chill and just because I can. So I believe that's everything. I, I don't wanna take this out. So isn't this really pretty too? I love the design that she did. So this is day 12. And then I'm gonna go ahead and zoom you in so we can see everything together. Oh, this is so, so pretty. I love this. Oh, is that a make? No way. <laughs> okay, okay, you guys, this is a makeup palette because of the brush down there. And I was I was wondering why the circles were not kiss cut around the border. Like there's a little bit of space left. I don't know if you can see that, but there's still that blue. But I realized it's because this is a makeup palette. I love that, that is so cute. Okay, so here's gold. This is so pretty. Okay, silver. Oh, I love this colorway. And then here's rose gold. See, her foiling is literally perfection. I am so happy with these and laptops are totally things you can use all the time. Or this is a monitor or a laptop, whatever you want it to be. And then these are beautiful. This is so pretty. These are like half scallops, 
so stunning. These are very, very popular. And it does take up the full width of a column. I'm just using the prototype of the TSKP Studio Planner. This is so pretty. I love this colorway. This is it in gold. And then here is, oh, this is gold in another colorway. So this is totally more neutral. I love this. And then here's a more bright colorway. This is really, really pretty. To be honest with you, I don't use a lot of bright colors and spreads in general, but when I do use Planning World kits, they do tend to have colors like this, and I'm always surprised by how I do enjoy the spreads a lot. And I do just try to go ahead and expand, you know, my colorways and try different things. So I totally will be able to use some of these colors. If not, I'll go ahead and pass it on to a friend or something, but this is really pretty. So same thing, but this is it in silver. I love this neutral colorway. So pretty. And then here it is in silver with the other colorway. Same thing with rose gold. Rose gold and pink are just a match made in heaven. So stunning. And then rose gold with the brighter colorway. Really, really pretty. So this was day 12. So exciting. And that's what came in at day 12. So I'm gonna go ahead and just start taking everything out. Again, this is top heavy because I got all three foil colors. <laughs> all right, so here is, oh, did I lose a sleeve? Okay, so this is day 11. Oh my gosh, again, I love the concept. I think, I wonder if her whole advent is based off of makeup. This is really awesome. So again, another makeup palette, but this has nail polish in it, so pretty. Oh, these are nail polish icons, gold, silver, and rose gold. I am so happy I went ahead and got all three foil colors because I would feel almost like naked or incomplete without all three foil colors. <gasps> Oh my gosh, <laughs> this is so pretty. You certainly get so much on one sheet, you guys. This is stunning. Oh, you want, I love this. This is like the perfect sized and shaped hexagon. It's not too small, it's not too big. And then this colorway is so pretty. It's got stars all over it. This is the gold, so pretty. I love that. And then again, the other colorway, which is definitely this more bright colorway. Here it is in gold. This is so pretty. Like, I'm gonna honestly be able to utilize these neutral colors here more, but when it comes to like the purples and blues and bright greens and stuff, I probably won't be able to use those as much because that's not really a colorway I tend to use. Here is silver. So pretty. You guys know I'm just a neutral heart altogether. So, <laughs> And then here's silver in the brighter colorway. I do appreciate Yuan offering two different colorways though because she totally could have just gone with one, but she did go with two, which is amazing. Here's rose gold. So pretty. I'm very impressed with the size of these hexagons. They are literally the perfect size. So that is day 11. Okay, so the next one all right so here is day 10 oh this is so 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 pretty here are beds oh these are so cute i love the detail of these beds and they're so tiny i love this love love here it is in silver again same makeup palette and then um, rose gold, super pretty. All of the detail and artwork that she puts in every single sheet is amazing. So those are the bed icons. Oh my gosh, these are so pretty. I'm going to get so much use out of this. I love that detail and it's just so simple. It's not excessive so you can still, you have plenty of room to write on this. This is really nice, you guys. So these are half boxes. They will take up the full width of a column. Here's the gold in the neutral colorway, gold in the more bright colorway, silver. This is so pretty. And then I also like the heart details there too. 
Wow, okay, rose gold and these colors are literally perfection. I love that so much. And then here is rose gold with the brighter colorway. Really pretty. So this is day 10. I'm starting to run out of space on my desk. <laughs> day 10, okay. Next is day nine. So here are laptops. So the first one was definitely a monitor, like a desktop monitor. Here's day 12. So here is day nine. These are certainly laptops, really pretty. The same same artwork again with the, the makeup palette, so pretty. And then rose gold. Okay, I am so happy that she made flags because I truly do love flags and this is the perfect size. The sizing is perfection. I feel like I'm totally going to use these a lot in my weekly spreads because I do like to mark work using flags and these are the perfect size. They're very comparable to the mini, mini confetti flags I use from Clever Gal Crafts. So I love that. This is the gold neutral colorway and here is the gold brighter colorway. You get so much on a sheet, you guys. You get so much. Like this is, this is the sheet of like, the size of like a full um, A5 wide kit page. Does that make sense? <laughs> Here's silver. Really, really pretty. I love that green. That green is stunning. That's so pretty. And then rose gold. Wow. You guys, this is beautiful. And these are like little heart confettis. Probably hard to see on camera, but this is so nice. And then here is the brighter colorway in rose gold. So this was day nine. I feel like Christmas, like I'm opening everything at one time. So here is day eight. Oh my gosh, you guys. Yuan, I don't know how you end up putting so much detail in the smallest icons, but it's absolutely impressive. These are spray bottles, which is you know, totally relevant <laughs> right now. So really perfect to mark cleaning. The same makeup design, silver. And then here is rose gold. So, so pretty, I love her rose gold. And then, oh my gosh, this is so, okay. I'm like trying to count the, the, the rows, two, four, six, seven. So you do get a full set of seven rows, where you can make this like a Monday through Sunday sidebar tracker. I love this. There's stars, hanging stars, and then confetti stars down there. Here's gold. So this would fit perfectly in the sidebar. Here's the brighter colorway in gold. Silver. Silver in the brighter colorway. This is so pretty. Rose gold. So this was day eight, really, really pretty. All right, so to day seven. Okay, these are desks, really nice. I love the chair. Again, the detail, you guys, so stunning. Here's gold, silver, and rose gold. Super gorgeous. So those are the icons. Oh, I am going to get so much use out of this page. You have tons of quarter boxes here. And then here you have like heart confetti and then confetti, um, or sorry, star confettis and then heart corner confettis down here. I don't know my shapes. <laughs> this is so pretty. Here it is in gold. The bright colorway in gold. Silver and neutral. I love those hearts. Let me zoom. Let me just get you guys close and personal. How beautiful is that? Here is silver in the bright colorway. Then rose gold. So pretty. And then rose gold in the bright colorway. This was day seven. All right. So now to day six. Yes, coffee cups. I am so happy. <laughs> I love coffee cups. And you guys, these icons I typically wouldn't use in my memory spreads, but 
I'm really, really excited to be using these in my neutral B6 just because they're the perfect size to use in my B6 rings and B6 TN. And they're just really simple. I love this. So coffee cups, here's silver, and then rose gold. Rose gold is so pretty. These are so nice. I think these are just really thin washi strips. I think these would be maybe a good mix between 10 mil millimeters and um, five millimeter washi strips. I'm not 100% sure, but they're pretty perfect. Like I love the size. It's not too thick or too um, thin. So it would take up a full left side. So if you wanted to go ahead and take up the full you know, cover up the full section on the left side or where the sidebar is, you can cover that whole section. So that's basically the perfect length for that side. But of course it wouldn't take up the, the other side. So here is the gold in the neutral colorway. This is so pretty. It's got hanging banner stars. So pretty. Here is the bright colorway in gold. Silver, this is so pretty. And you can totally, you know, use this in a column and then just trim it down with an X-Acto knife or slice tool. This is so pretty. And I can't wait to probably try this out in, in like a monthly section. How nice would that be? Because it would take up like full, um, three full boxes and that would be a nice way to, you know, mark travel or something. Here's rose gold in neutral and then rose gold in the bright color away. All right, so this was day six. There are so many more days to still go. <laughs> now I understand why people break this up daily. I totally get it. So here's day five. Oh my gosh. Oh, those are balloons. They are so pretty. Perfect to mark birthdays in like a calendar functional planner. I love this. Here's gold, silver, and then rose gold, so pretty. It's just like a bunch of balloons, I love that. Okay, so next, oh yes, yes. Okay, so she made full sheets of third boxes. I was hoping this was gonna be in the advent as well. And I love that design of the heart and the little like squiggle. So, so pretty. You guys know I'm gonna use this page so much. Here's a gold, gold in the bright colorway. Silver. And then rose gold. So the advent so far has had half boxes, quarter boxes, and now third boxes. So you get so many boxes. And I appreciate how neutral and functional the you know stickers are that she put in with this. So that was day five. Here is day four. Oh, this is so cute. It's like a journal or a planner. I love that. So that's it in gold and there's a little pen as well, silver. And then here is rose gold. So, so pretty. Okay, I love these. You guys, I absolutely adore this, this page. This is literally the perfect sized flag and that is one thing that I'm very impressed with in this advent is the sizing of everything is just perfect. So these are heart flags. When I say perfect, like I love these kinds of flags. Like they're not too wide and not too tall. So I don't have to really do very much when it comes to trimming anything. And it's just the perfect size. I love this. I like to kind of stack two on top of each other sometimes depending on my mood. <laughs> so there's gold in the neutral colorway. Here's gold in the bright colorway. Silver. This is so pretty. I appreciate that she did hearts and stars. I don't think I've seen too many bows or if, honestly, I don't think I've seen bows at all. And then here is um, the silver in the bright colorway and then rose gold. So pretty, so much foil, you guys. All the quality and amount of foil you get in this advent is amazing. So this was day four. All right, now to day three, we are coming to an end here. Almost 20 minutes now. <laughs> this is day three. Oh, this is so cute. These are car icons. It's like a little bug car. Love this. Just love the artistry that went into this advent. So, so pretty. Silver and then rose gold. 
And then, oh, these are really pretty. So I'm gonna be honest here. I'm not a huge fan of arrows. Like I don't use them often in general. I do like to use like smaller arrows in my functional B6 planners. So I may pass this along, but I might keep like the neutral colorways because I do love just like a smaller arrow. And this is like a medium sized one. So it would take up maybe three fourths of um, a little half of the column. So really, really pretty. And then here it is in gold with the bright colorway silver it's got a bunch of like confetti foil i love that i love how like you know imperfect it looks like it's not perfectly splattered if that makes sense but it still looks perfect <laughs> and then here's rose gold still super pretty i'm just a little bit indecisive about this one um still really gorgeous i'm just not sure if i'm going to be able to get a lot of use out of that okay so day two we're almost done here is day two Oh, these are like moving boxes. I love this. Or packages, whatever you wanna you know, use it for, but this is pretty. So gold and the detail, you literally can see a label detail. I don't know if you can see that. You on, your detail is amazing. And then rose gold, really pretty. So these are like package or box icons. And then, okay, now we're talking. Here are full sheets of headers. This is amazing. I love Yuan's headers. And this just has like splatter confetti, which I like because it's not like your traditional bow or even hearts. Like it's just a bunch of confetti splattered everywhere. <laughs> love this in gold. Here's a bright colorway in gold. Silver neutral colorway. Silver bright colorway. Rose gold neutral colorway and rose gold bright colorway. Really, really pretty. So this was day two. Now we are finalizing the advent. Here is day one. I'm so, so excited. Yeah, this is like probably my favorite out of the entire calendar. I am so, so pleased with that. Okay, so here are some utensil icons, which I love. This is very, very versatile and you can use this all the time. Super pretty. Silver and then rose gold. I love that. Okay, so you have icons for days, but seriously, look at these corner scallops. Oh, and this, she has the bow. I don't think I've, I don't think anything else had bows. I love, love the day one. This is so amazing. Just the detailing of like the doily detailing there and then the bows, and you just get so much on one page. This is incredibly amazing. You really get your money's worth too. So here is gold in the bright colorway, silver in the neutral colorway. I love this. You guys, this is so pretty. The only hiccup I would have about this is if you wanted to flip it or use it in you know different corners, the bow would be upside down. That is the only thing I would have recommended was maybe reversing and flipping this so that the bow would not be upside down because then you can't like use it in this corner. Well, technically you can still see the bow, so it doesn't really matter, but it just depends on your preference, but still really, really beautiful. Here's a bright colorway in silver and then rose gold. Oh, so much foil. I love this. I'm mesmerized because this is so pretty. Then rose gold in the bright colorway. So this was day one, and that is the entire advent calendar, you guys. So this was everything from Planning World's advent calendar, 12 full days of beautiful, amazing quality foil. All right, so that was everything from the Planning World advent calendar for 2020. I got 12 full days worth of amazing, high quality foiled stickers on premium matte paper and I'm really, really excited. Yuan, you did an amazing job and I hope that you guys enjoyed this. If you went ahead and got an advent calendar yourself, let me know how you liked it below. I'm really excited to hear your thoughts. Again, if you wanna purchase anything from Planning World, you can use Rachel15 to save. Thanks so much for watching. I hope that you're doing well. I'll talk to you next time. Bye.